global internet population is bordering on 300 million. The number of internet users will increase to about 11.8% of the global population in 2005. This means about 800 million people will be using the internet. Internet users have become younger with the majority composed of youths including teenage students. Their main interest is games. The global game industry currently stands at about $160 billion. It has already exceeded other components of the overall global entertainment industry, including the movie and film sectors, the largest component in the past. The game industry continues to grow by more than 25% every year. Prominent global companies have come to perceive games as a cultural industry, thus advancing into the industry. Games are no longer regarded simply as an amusement source for children, but as a universal language and a medium for cultural exchange. Hence, games are becoming a major access of the global entertainment industry. Games are the most prominent area of the global entertainment industry in the 21st century. Games are a common language of youth around the world. Thus, the World Cyber Games aims to be the epicenter of this 21st century cultural revolution. The World Cyber Games are an annual event comprised of the world's first and foremost global game competition, a game conference, and a game exhibition. Through the game conference, the world's top game industry professionals will have the opportunity to exchange information and ideas. The game exhibition will provide the general public with the world's greatest game festival. The philosophy driving the establishment of the World Cyber Games was to promote a new cyber culture via games that transcends physical borders and cultural barriers to bring people together. The World Cyber Games will lead the development of global youth culture. To achieve such goals in a structured and efficient manner, the World Cyber Games plans to establish the ICOC in 2001, comprised of global opinion leaders. The development of a vast global business network will also be pursued alongside the establishment of the ICOC. This global business network will provide a new business paradigm for the game-related industry. Based on the ICOC and the global business network, the World Cyber Games will expand the number of participating countries to 70 by 2005. To be labeled as a true Cyber Olympics, cooperative relations will also be established with partners. The World Cyber Games will pursue long-term partnerships with partners in all locales to create more win-win business opportunities. The World Cyber Games will establish both an online and offline foundation for growth in the game industry. As the warm-up event to the first official World Cyber Games, the World Cyber Game Challenge was held in October 2000 with the support of the Ministry of Culture and Tourism and the Ministry of Information and Communication. 170 players from 17 countries were brought to Korea to compete in four official game events and three demonstration game events for a total purse in excess of $200,000. Many prominent press agencies such as CNN, BBC, RTL2 and Canal Plus provided coverage of the World Cyber Game Challenge around the world. 500,000 gamers worldwide viewed the games being broadcast live over the internet. The World Cyber Game Challenge received a favorable review by Computer Gaming World, one of the world's top game magazines with a North American circulation of 300,000. The magazine contained a special feature on the event forecasting the success of the games. The Game World, the exhibit of game characters, movies and games themselves attracted 150,000 visitors. Global opinion leaders like Nigel Sandiford of Electronic Arts and Bruce Shelley of Ensemble Studios participated in the game forum to promote the development of the game industry. Thus, the concept underlying the World Cyber Games was shown to be capable of making great contributions to the development of the global games industry.
The first World Cyber Games will be held in December 2001 in Korea. Approximately 400 gamers from about 30 countries will be invited to the final tournament. $300,000 will be available in prize money for the five official game events. As participating regions expand to include the South American and African continents, console games will also be included in the official game event lineup. Game methods will also be diversified to include multiplayer, team-based games. The game conference involving various industry leaders and the game exhibition will also be expanded to a larger capacity with support from the Korean government. In the first World Cyber Games, an official server, Genius, will be launched to strengthen online efforts. This official server, Genius, will be an important tool in administrating the qualifying rounds. It will also be utilized to provide a vehicle for cyber cultural interchange among World Cyber Game partners all year round. The first World Cyber Games will be the greatest event of the new millennium, held under the auspices and leadership of the ICOC, the Korean government, the participating gamers and major broadcast and news groups from countries all around the world.